Welcome to our lecture online. Our fourth example deals with receiving the value for the y-intercept and a point on the line. How do we find the equation of the line now? Well, since they give us the y-intercept, we should start by plugging it in right here. So let's do that first. We have y is equal to mx plus, and instead of b, they tell us what the y-intercept is, we'll write the letter 4, or not the letter, the number 4. There we go. Okay, so now that we have the intercept, let's rewrite the equation. So we have y equals mx plus 4. Now we need to find m. And so what we're going to do now is take the value of the one point that's given and plug the x and y coordinates in for the x and y in our equation. So then we get the following. So we see that y is equal to 2. So we write 2 is equal to m times x and x is equal to 3 and plus 4. And now we can use this, we can solve this equation to find the value for m. So first we move the 4 to the other side, so we have 2 minus 4 equals 3m, minus 2 equals 3m, divide both sides by 3, so we get negative 2 over 3 equals m. And so now we have found the slope of the line as well, which we can plug back into the equation right there. And when we do, we can rewrite the equation. y is equal to, and instead of m, we're going to write minus 2 thirds x, and then we have plus 4 for the intercept. And that is how we find the equation of a line if we're given the intercept and one point. That is how it's done.